Good morning and welcome back to The Daily Vitamin, where you get your daily dose of spiritual sweetness. <laughs> um, if I'm getting it, I'm going to share it with you guys. I'm just going to give you all a disclaimer. I don't think today is going to be PG-13. <laughs> Maybe it is. I don't know. I don't know. I'll just, let me just get into it. So uh, first card up, we have Lake Stillness. Followed by clouds, shape shifting, and the caboose is fire. <laughs> Passion. I don't know why this keeps like the caboose in today's lineup. Like this is like the final car in today's train. But we've got fire, passion. I'll tell you what. So I'll share with you the vision. <laughs> the vision that came through right along with these cards today there is oh man now i'm seeing the heron so there's my eyes just landed on the little heron here on the back of the card <laughs> so i'm showing you so heron is all about like you know think about like the stork bringing in a new baby you know like maybe literally maybe literally but just like bringing in bringing in new things right there's a lot of like creativity ushering and change so here's the vision that i'm feeling uh, come on through today. So there is something that seems like uh, there's not a whole lot of action, a whole not a whole not a whole lot of response or engagement on the surface. But just like with a pond or a lake, even though it's still on the surface, beneath the surface is teeming with life. Like shit that you've never even heard of before is living beneath that surface. Here's like unknown territory existing beneath the surface of that still water so i feel like <laughs> your spiritual team is showing up to tell you that there is a whole lot changing beneath the surface and it is all fueled by passion and the passion that came through today now passion can be many many things you know you can be passionate about epicurious adventures right you could be passionate about you know your entire house being beige and neutral tones like you'd be passionate about many many different things that other people may not be so passionate about but this kind of passion today this is very much connected to like primal animalistic desires um it, i mean this is pure raw like appetite <laughs> to put it nicely this is this is appetite Whew, man okay there's a lot of it there's a lot of it and this could represent um, you know maybe someone who has been holding back attraction feelings emotion um intention desires fantasy like all all that good stuff like all the good juicy stuff it's kind of been hanging out <laughs> beneath the surface, right? Maybe you have no idea. Maybe this is just a little secret admirer, a little looky-loo, maybe a neighbor who checks you out every once in a while and over time they're like, man, every time she takes her garbage out, she's looking fly. Like, who knows? Who knows what this is? Everyone is gonna be a little different here. But I'm getting I'm getting a strong feeling that you got a strong sense of who this is. Um, <laughs> Okay, I just heard eagle eye. So like this could be maybe maybe you've had your eye on this person. You know, you could you could have your eyes on each other. You know what I mean? Like you could have like target locked and loaded on each other. However, maybe nothing has happened or nothing has been happening or nothing has really transpired as of yet. Um, but that's that's not it's not going to stay still for for much longer. This feels like an, an incredible oh man I'm, i keep getting the shivers like it's so powerful um this is an incredibly intense attraction an incredibly intense connection on this lake i just so there's a couple of visions that i want to share with you but i'll share with you first this lake i just had a vision of a swan chilling out on top of the lake and another swan flying in and landing on the lake disturbing the water right and swans to me usually represent like this is this is your eternal love like this is your life partner this is this is your beloved this is your perfect match your twin flame whatever you want to call it twin flames i have a whole opinion on what that is but um whenever i see the swans especially like this this is partnership this is like we're we're 
linked, you know, like our souls are linked, our, our hearts are interwoven and interconnected. This is a really, really deep bond. So this shape shifting that's going on beneath the surface, I feel like is going to eventually, yeah, timing is a weird thing with energy. Um, it will eventually disturb the surface of the waters, right? That, that second partner, <laughs> the partner swan will come in. I'm laughing because so every morning when I go on my walk, there's this one goose. I mean, I've been seeing her for months. She was there all winter long. I was like, don't you guys migrate? Like, what are you doing here? But we have mild winters where I live. Anyway, she's, she is in the same spot. She's on like this same hill every single morning. Every single morning I see this one lone goose by herself. And I, I've, I formed an attachment. I actually really like her. I've been thinking of naming her, but you know, she comes with her own name. I just don't know it yet. Anyway, she makes me feel like, you know, the, the forlorn love, like that longing, like, you know, her, her beloved is lost at sea and she will never abandon her post on this hill as she waits for him to return. <laughs> you know? Like I just, every single day, I kind of hope that I don't see her because that would mean that like her, her partner came in, you know, like her man came home and they're like off, you know, eating grass on another hill together, but she has not abandoned her post. And so anyway, so that's, that's maybe that's, you know, something that feels relevant for your situation. Like maybe your heart has not abandoned this, this love, this attraction, this connection. No matter what life has looked like, no matter what seasons you have moved through, right? Because again, it was always really pronounced to me that like, why is this goose here in winter time? Like you shouldn't be here, you know? Like you don't you have other business to tend to, like other places to be. But it's like she 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 maintained. The other vision that I had coming through is that this moment that you're in right now is like a brief moment of electrified how do I even put this it's like an electrified pause okay so this is how the scene is playing out it's like there's some kind of um <laughs> it's like a scene from a movie like I feel like I'm, I'm watching a scene from a movie like one person confesses their feelings to another person and they both just kind of stare at each other wide-eyed like oh my god I've been feeling this way and I'm so intensely in love with you and, blah, 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 and just like you know completely just <laughs> like spilling all of these pent up feelings and emotions and the intensity and just like all of it and just like you know kind of waiting for the other person to respond as they like stare at each other like you know that it's like that brief moment of pause before, before they get down you know what I'm saying <laughs> before like there, there are no more words that you can put around it it's like at this point we let the bodies do the talking you know what I mean like there's a there's a physical grounding of this energy so, like I said, I don't know. I'm trying to I'm trying to bring this message through in a way that um, you know it's, it's safe for work. Uh, you're probably listening to this before breakfast, and I don't know how heated you want to get <laughs> before you have your morning coffee. Uh, yeah, I don't know. Maybe you do. That's whatever. I'm not even. I'm not even gonna. I'm gonna stop right there. I'm gonna stop right there. I feel like you got the message. <laughs> I feel like you got it. I feel like I'm getting bashful now. I'm getting a little shy. So. I'm gonna tuck that bad boy away. I feel you got the message. This is just a brief pause, but there is just a whole lot of sweltering heat and yumminess beneath the surface. So have fun, I wish you luck, and I will see you tomorrow. Bye.